in my view, it's a tea party song. It sounds like a tea party there. Canadian movie. Ah, it was big on the 90s. I, think. Okay. I would say that it has a, a quite unique groove. Uh, and, uh, I think that we have uh, uh, guest performances by uh, Michael Blair uh, on a couple of songs. Uh, Michael Blair as a percussionist who's played with Tom Waits and Luke Reed and so many great artists and he, he uh, makes some great contributions to the to the groove on, on this song. Uh, so I, if you get the chance, listen, listen hard to that. Yeah. Yeah. Amazing drum. Yeah. Yeah. Very. There is, there is no editors. No, no. no just, editors. just one take, one, one, you know, all the way through, and it's totally, totally yeah. killing it. It has some kind of noise cult feel. I think, yeah. That song. Yeah. yeah. The harmonies and the way it sounds and the atmosphere. Yeah. I think it turned out very, very good that song as well. Yeah, yes, that was an extra. Actually. They yeah. broke it just and we yeah. rehearsed the chorus from the last rehearsal yeah. before the recordings. Because we, we watched this uh, the live live and uh, deaths of Robert Durst, the Jinx, yeah. on yeah. HBO, yeah. Uh, Syria, TV, TV series. And we were all talking about it and we were you know, so you know, excited like about it. The day after yeah. we've all seen the last episode, Leif came with it. So. Yeah, it came in with this. Yeah. I have a song, yeah. it's going to be called uh, Run for the Run. Yeah. Ah. But then uh -huh. you changed the chorus, do you remember? Yeah. yeah. You heard it with one? Three times. Three times. Three times, okay. Yeah. Change the minute. Send away your prayers, hammer down. It was uh, our tribute to one of the greatest bands of all time, uh, Mountain. That's and, uh, his opinion. Yeah. <laughs> Mountain is uh, one of my absolute favorite bands. And then, um, and Leslie West, the guitar players. There's a lot of we can hear a lot of that from what I do in the song. And I was searching for the Leslie West sound for about a very very long time. <laughs> I found a pedal that was broken, but it sounded amazing. So, but I had to switch because it was broken because it has too much humming in it. And then I got a new one, but that one didn't sound as good, so I had to call them and tell them to not fix the pedal <laughs> and get the pedal back so I could finish the recordings. With a broken pedal. <laughs> With a broken pedal. That's why it sounds That's good. That's a good story. <laughs> it sounds good because it was broken. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, it's also very nice lyric about the uh, navvies who uh, built the Build the uh, railways in Sweden and in Scandinavia. Uh, they were, you know, rough, rough life and, and, and tough conditions, of yeah. course. So, so that's another powerful lyric. And Leif has, Leif Edling has, really a, a great sense or or about telling a story. Yeah. Uh, and and I would say that all of these songs are in their own ways, they hold strong stories, and this one in particular. As you say, it's about the navvies uh, and their contrib contributions to uh, to Sweden, of course, but I mean, they, they were navvies all around the world. Yeah. yeah. And uh, this song is a bit different, I would say, in, in instrumentation and sound, so we had to Work on. Uh, ah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> got background. Marcus, the background only vocals. song with background yeah. vocals. <laughs> yeah. He fakes and he I think we're all pushing our abilities a lot uh, on that song. And initially, it was written with a quite uh, with a plain chorus that I, I do with the first and the second chorus quite similarly, uh, uh, similar and. Uh, and I was doing the demo vocals, and, and at the end I felt that oh, something is missing. We need something to, to lift it. And uh, so I, I tried ad living and that turned out as the third or the last, absolute last chorus, which really uh, is the reason why I think you're, you're uh, saying that it's a Shirley Bassett song. Okay, yeah. Of course, <laughs> Shirley came around and said, 
Hello. It's a great way to, to finish the album, and maybe it's also a great way to finish our little conversation about <laughs> the album. We're so happy about this album, and we hope that you will enjoy it as much as we do. So, um, see you on the road. Cheers. Cheers.